Thousands demonstrated in Cardiff as they called for an independent Wales in what organisers said was the first such march in Welsh history. The event was organised by All Under One Banner Cymru and supported by Yes Cymru, Awoken Cymru and Welsh football fans for independence. People travelled from all across Wales to take part and their cries for an independent nation were not unrecognised by the town. It's estimated that over 1,000 people and as many as 3,000 attended the march which began at City Hall before proceeding along Queen Street, The Hayes and concluding in front of the Central Library. But what's your thoughts on an independent Wales? Do you, do you like the idea or are you completely against it or and, and, and why so? Um, no, I don't think we can survive on our own. I just don't think we're a big enough country. I think we'd struggle as an independent country on our own. I think if we were still part of Europe and we could apply to Europe to be part of that infrastructure, I think we'd survive. I mean, I don't really care, but Welsh independence, you know, it's right, like, yeah. yeah. Not bad, like. Do you think we'd be able to cope on our own outside of the UK? Do you think we'd do all right or not? See, I don't think we, do. I don't, I don't think we will, see. Yeah. I don't think we will. I, don't, I just think, like, we need, like, people like England and, you know, all of you. Ireland, Scotland, and all that. I think like we need them. But you know, if we do go independent, then we'll see how it goes, innit? I think it's a brilliant idea. And Welsh independence is right having a rucksack and having your sandwiches in there, in your rucksack, so you can feed yourself. You can have your three meals a day. Otherwise, you'll come into town, right? And you'll have to run here, run there, everywhere, and then you can't think where you're going because you you, you end up depleted. 